Hi there, weight loss girl. This is Jessica. So it is true. Um, I saw your video. Uh, somebody had actually posted on my page uh, that maybe you were having similar issues as myself. So I searched your videos, found yours, and decided that maybe I should message you. Um, when it comes to um, the potassium, I don't know if anybody out there has watched this video. The potassium is very painful to get through the IV. That is a very painful. A vitamin to get through IV. Um, so I actually had them take it out of my arm at one point. Um, a lack of potassium would make your legs hurt. So if you were having issues with your leg cramping up, potassium is huge. Um, also with potassium, um, there's something that you can do that might be beneficial to you that at your point was very good for me, is to take a banana, cut it in half, put it on a stick, a um, popsicle stick, uh, and put it into a bag, individual bags, and freeze them. Eat them like ice pops. That was the only way I could get in my potassium, and that worked for me. <clears throat> also, um, there's something called Go Bananas. Uh, depends. Once you're so far out, you'll be able to start adding more sugar and stuff. I think it has 12 grams of per, uh, 12 grams of sugar in it, and it's just a dark chocolate-covered banana. Not as much chocolate as you would think, but um, that's been very helpful too. Now at this point, it's my sweet treat um, if I've done good all day. Um, also, protein is huge. If you don't get enough protein in, I went um, about, about your point of surgery, um, out of surgery without protein, and I lost use of my legs for two months and I had to have physical therapy. I was unable to walk without a walker for a month. Um, it was about two months before I was able to walk by myself. Um, walking to the bathroom from my bedroom, I would fall. Um, I would fall standing up from the bathroom, um, taking a shower, things like that. Uh, was not something I could do by myself. I had to sit on the side of the tub or have somebody there with me. At one point, it took me 20 minutes to get out of the bottom of the tub. Um, I was very tempted to call and beg for somebody to help me stand up because my legs just wouldn't. At one point, I actually fell down, dragged myself to the bedroom, and had to pull myself up on the bed using my arm muscles as much as I could because I could not physically put my feet on the ground and stand up. So lack of protein will take away your muscle. Um, so if you're having trouble, and this is what I'm getting to this point where you were saying that everything was making you throw up, um, make sure if they haven't already, go down in and look and have what's called like a gastro whatever. They put a tube down in and they take a look at your stomach. Um, it sounds painful, but they actually put you asleep. You don't recall it. It's worth having it done. I was scared to death when I went in for it. Um, but I don't recall it and I've had it done multiple times since. My stomach um, had stricture at the bottom where it closed up so bad it was like a pinhole. Um, I got to the point where I was like you, where I was just throwing up in the morning. Then I just started throwing up kind of all the time. I wasn't able to hold anything really down. Protein was very difficult. That's what got me to my leg point. Um, but they had to go in and reopen it up. Um, so that's where it kind of my story kind of circled around. Make sure that if you're unable to get your protein in, try to figure out something because if you can't, um, you will lose things like your legs. Um, so I just want to let you know that my name is Jessica, so it is true. Um, I'm on Facebook, Jessica Burbank on Facebook. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Um, hopefully you're feeling better. It's only been a couple of days since the last time you posted. I saw you. You looked kind of like how I did at your point. Believe me, it will get better. Um, emotional and stuff. I'm sorry for your loss, and I can see that you're really emotional, and believe me, at, when you, I was at your position, um, I was exactly where you are now. Um, so if you have any questions, feel free to ask. That's what I'm here for. Uh, and I hope that you're feeling better. And um, I hope all is well with you. And again, sorry for your loss. And I hope that um, if you have any questions, uh, you're not scared to ask. Okay? Have a great night. And um, peace out. <laughs>